Okay. You're speaking about the barrier. Is this recording? No. Well, that's a yes then. <laughs> but anyway, we were just speaking about the barrier. And. Yeah. The, the bone can't go Explain the barrier. This was when I was in front and my helmet camera was on. There was a nice kind of straight, it wasn't flat but it was straight, a bit of road going ahead so I could see all along it and it was going up slightly and being in front with the camera on I just thought yeah let's let rip and so I was bombing it and accelerating and then suddenly at the very last minute I saw this metal bar barrier across the road. I dived down like that and managed to get under, I hit my shoulder on it luckily the arm has taken most of it and it's got like a shine on it where it hit the metal but then i ended up kind of mirror yeah well the mirror i noticed was cracked after which shows how how low and how little space i had for that to hit the bar but i ended up kind of towards the hedge almost in the hedge at the right hand side of the road and all the guards came running down from around I turned around and the bar was going like that, bouncing up and down, and the policeman came out of his hut and was getting mad and telling everyone where to park. And luckily one of the other officials told him that I'd gone round the barrier instead of rammed into it and gone under. But I was just saying that when I went back to give you to your uh, car notes after we'd had them stamped, I looked down on the ground where the Africa twins were parked and there was about that long was a skid in the dirt which is obviously where I braked but it was less than five meters away from the pole and when we were watching the video back last night you just see I just didn't see it till I was meters away from it and I must have been doing 75 80 I don't know it's hard to say but I was going too fast for when there's a barrier in the road you can see the, the forks compressing and juddering under the front brake and the uh, helmet can play back the, um, so this is the Congo, the Gabon Congo border. Yeah. Or should I say the No Man's uh, Land no Congo man's land border? Congo. Yeah. And I literally ran almost into didn't it. make it into Congo. Yeah. You killed yourself in the way. Three through. quarters of my body would have gone in, and a quarter would have been left in No Man's Land. And here we have kickboxer Jean Claude Van Damme on a 14-inch screen, dubbed into French. And here we have a bottle of Primus. This was in Gok. In Gok, the Congo. It's all good.